with me. Our plan is that we're going to go to Northwest Departure as per usual, head for Kemper, then head straight east to um, Lake in the Hills. 12305 is their their number. So I've got that down. So that's 123 Lake in the Hills. Get the Adas, Executive Round, Cessna 601 Golf, at Area 2, we depart to the North Wolf and Peace, whatever. Their instructions. Then Executive Tower, right before we're about to get off, holding short of one or whatever, ready for departure. Their instructions. Our check. Yeah. It's a waste of time for me. I'm not ready for my 10 hour check. Anyway. No? Okay. What do you need? What do you think you need? More. More what? Everything. I mean 10 hours check is just it's just to critique your your uh, your progress. And my critique my my uh, what I taught you you're a good instructor I got no problem with you but it's just that you know and it, and it gives you an idea of what what to expect in the check ride I'm a slow learner tack and hobs have been recorded seat belts seats yeah. belts shoulder harnesses are on fuel shut off valve is on that was checked before mm -hmm. radio and my electricals are off circuit breakers are in this thing was up this thing was up I put it down mm -hmm. that was it should have been down before I turned on the master Mm -hmm. Car repeat is off, mixture is full, rich, so full, rich. Mm -hmm. Priming is required, I always do. Let it fill up. That's a, like a cylinder, it has to fill up first and then you push it in. I did not know that. Did not know that. Oh yes, I feel a little bit more resistance. Engine's primed. Throttle to be open for one quarter inch. Boom. Master switch is on. Rotating beacon is on. Nav lights we don't need. Clear! I don't see anybody hanging around waiting to be cut up. Brakes are on. Ignition switch, engage starter. One hand on the When you're cranking, you have a one hand on here, crank like that. In case it rubs up. Well, pressure's in the green, my flaps are up. Contact. Advise an initial contact. You have information, Oscar. Okay, I'm, well, 
stop mowing as long as I have information, Oscar. Everything was cool. The winds are from the north at 8 degrees, uh, 10 miles per hour. Visibility is uh, 10 miles, statute miles. Uh, sky condition is clear. Temperature is nice. I don't have to feel the my mixture. Now, temperature 3015. Let me check this. 301. Runway 34 and 35. We're set for the altimeter. Uh, my understanding is that uh, 1634 and 30 are in use. So he's probably going to send us any which way. Uh, we're in area two, right here. So he could very well send us Bravo Wind to Kilo to the 34 pad and wait. Or he could send us Bravo Echo Kilo to the 16 pad. So he can send you uh, to Alpha to the 34 pad. Alpha to the 34 pad. Alpha is right over there. So I would go that way and straight that way. That's right there. I would prefer that, but uh, we'll see what he says. Okay, so uh, I have my executive aid as I'm at Oscar identifier. Uh, I'm going to kind of change my um, frequency. Frequency cursor. Cursor. 121.7 for executive ground. And uh, could you do me a favor and uh, leave the um, GoPro on for the entire uh, duration of the uh, lesson? I would appreciate that. Huh? Okay, so 121.7. So this is what we're going to do. We have our flight plan established. The plane looks as, as been pre flighted. Uh, weather's excellent. Uh, four, four. My transponder's on. My altimeter's been set. Uh, our game plan is head towards Lake in the Hills. Might do a touch and go. Might do a landing. Uh, could possibly practice some slow flight coming back. Okay. We might go stall also. No, oh, that would be nice, yes. But uh, basically, we will be going towards Kemper first. Kemper will be a heading of approximately 3.30. Once we hit Kemper, head straight west for uh, Lake in the Hills. Do you concur? Yes, I do. I'm going to be contacting Executive Ground at 121.7. I'm going to say the following. Executive Ground, Cessna 600 Golf at Area 2, Department of the Northwest with the ATIS information, Oscar. He will reply back, then I will read back to him, and then we're going to go, go, go. Do you concur? I concur. Excellent. Nice when people concur. Here goes. Right. Executive ground, Cessna 6001 Golf, Area 2, depart to the northwest with ATIS Oscar. Cessna 6001 Golf, Executive ground, runway 34, taxi via Alpha, cross 30. Departing runway 34, taxi via Alpha, crossing 301 Golf. Okay, he's sending us to Alpha. We're going to cross runway 30. We have permission. Coming out Shirley, 030 at 9 or altimeter 3018 and 01 Golf, he said northwest bound, correct? 01 Golf, northwest bound, correct. All right, let's go, let's go, let's go. Can't wait, can't wait. Yeah, once we call him, you better be ready. Because we got a jet and he's going to be waiting for you. Oh no, they put him on the runway. Slow down, you're going into the mud here. Going into the mud. There's a lot of mud. You, you didn't. You cut that corner too, too tight. Go out and then turn. You see that water right there? Yeah. It's it's not bad right now, but if you hit that one right there, you're gonna get stuck. Okay. That one you will get stuck. That one wasn't that bad. But watch your tires. Did you see your tire on the side? No, sir, I did not. Did you see your tire? Look down. No, sir, you did not. You can't see it. No. Like, uh, how come? I, how come I can see it? I can see my tire. You, you should be able to look down and look into your tire. I see it, yes, sir. I see it. Okay. So when you're taxiing, make sure you don't go cut cut in too soon. Go out and then turn. I'm making a right turn. That's correct. Yes, that's Hawthorne over there. Now stay on the center line, you're going too far to the left. You're not driving a car, so you don't have to be... Hello, ground, 208 Mike Fox, Hangar 12, ready to taxi after. I'm going to Alpha. 208 Mike Fox, ground 34, via Kilo, cross this is Alpha. We'll make a left here. Four, via Kilo. Oh, where's your, your runway? runway? Where do you think your runway is? Oh, my runway's over there. Which way? Which way's your runway? I gotta cross runway 30. Yeah, okay, where's runway 30? Runway 30 is right here. Okay, you got the sign right there. 3012. So that's the crossing runway right there. 
crossing runway you, you, you see the, the sign on the floor? Yes. That's your three zero. That's your crossing runway. He gave you permission to cross three zero. Okay, and then I'm going to make a left up here. No, that, you, how are you going to make a left on three zero? You're going to go the oh. three fours all the way up there. Okay. I want you to memorize that map. There's a three four pad right there. here and wait. Yes. And you're not going to wait. You're going to do your run-up. You'll do your run-up into the wind. You see the wind suck? Yes. You're going to go and then turn around and face into the wind here. Go like this. Like that. And then you've got plenty of room on this side. Turn into the wind. you got plenty of room to turn around. There's your wind, and you get right into the wind, and it's good. Okay. Now you can do your run-up. Thank you. I appreciate your assistance. Before takeoff, cabin, uh, doors and windows locked. Please close your windows, sir. Thank you. Mic control movements to check. So, aileron down, aileron up. Down, up. Down, and rudders. Flight controls have been visually affected. Check. Elevator trim is set to uh, position. When I visually inspected the elevator during the pre-flight, it seemed okay, except however this thing has got to be right there. Model the 1700. Engine instruments and suction gauge. Suction gauge right here. I'm sure that's a good. Yes. Magnetos. So to check the magnetos, I'm going to I'm going to turn this to the left first. To the left is the first notch, right? The left. To what do you say in the bottom? Magnetos. Left is the first one, right? Then you got the second one is the right. All right, so I'm going to check the first one and look for the drop. Touched a little bit. Back up. Now both. Touched a little bit. Well, that's not enough to really see. Heat, check for drop. Yes, it dropped. Good. Ammeter, check by splitting the master. Only the left one. Yes, it tiggled. Okay. Back on. Retard to idle. Back at a thousand. Flight instruments set. Uh, my compass, okay. Compass, my compass. It's about there. Um, radio is set to tower, which is 119.9. Pressure that in. Fuel, fuel shut off, confirmed down position. Mixture is full rich, confirmed. Transponder is to 1200. Flaps are up, landing lights I don't need. Uh, I'm ready to contact executive tower. Executive tower, Cessna 6001, golf holding short of one way 34, ready for departure. You concur? Yes. Thank you, I appreciate that. Executive Tower, Cessna 6001 Golf, holding short of runway 34, ready for departure. Cessna 6001 Golf, Executive Tower, taxi to hold short runway 34. 01 Golf, please repeat. Head Tower 8 Mike Fox, we need to cancel that clearance and head over to the pad. What are we going to do? 8 Mike Fox, I cancel take off clearance, so same intentions? Yeah, we need to go to the pad here and uh, check out a little something, and then we'll give you a call if we need to go back to the hangar or depart. Hey, my Fox, that guy's a the the four pad, zero one golf hold position. Zero one golf hold. Delta into the three four pad, a Mike Fox. Okay, what's happening? That guy has an engine problem. Okay, and I'm going to come over here to where we're, we're at. I'm sorry to hear that. So he's going to come around, and he's going to be parking right behind us. How nice. Over here. Okay. He's going to check his engines. Push. And then he's going to, then we're going to go, he's going to give us permission to fix the out there. Did I put my thing? Oh, there it is. Okay, sorry about that. Okay. Zero one golf, on course northwest, runway three four, clear for takeoff. Zero one golf, runway three four, clear for takeoff. That's it, let's go, let's go. Going. I'm pulling out that way. Correct? Right. Correct. Taxi. Fuck. 
I'm monkeying with that tip. That way. Do you see those signs, the red signs? Yes. That's the threshold of that runway. Okay. That's the beginning of that runway. Right, so, so we gave you permission, so get on the runway and take off. There. Yes. Am I going to hold my brakes and rev up? I want you to go straight and then go line it up. You don't have to hold your brakes that much. Okay. Uh, you, whatever you need. And because, we got five, because we got 5,000 We got five thousand feet of runway. Right, this ain't no short field, that's for sure. Getting ready to line up. Line it up and then just turn it. Uh, just like that. Alright, you're more or less lined up. You don't have to put your brakes on, just kick just kick it. Take your feet off the brakes. Down at the bottom. They're down. Watching the, watching the uh, speed. Alright, we've got crosswind, is this way. Okay. This is a crosswind takeoff. Okay. Right, take off. Alright, we've got a lot of airspeed here, so take off. Now, crosswind takeoff is not going to be Okay, nose down, a little bit in the trim tab. 
putting those down. Where's Kemper? Kemper's got to be that way. Uh, where's the cocoon? There, right. The cocoon, the cocoon. Um, there's a cocoon right there. See it? No, I don't see it. Right here, look at it. See it right there? Yes, I see the cocoon. I see the cocoon. Okay, now you're, you're outside of the cocoon. Here, God, we can circle east to west. That's got to be Kemper right there. Right. East wind is 0, 6, 0 at 1, 1, gust 1, 7.
I should have stayed with these guys, right? No, never mind. No, you don't, you don't have to stay with them. You could switch already. I doubt he's going to give you more advisors out here. Unless there's somebody coming straight inbound to the executive, but yeah, you can start switching if you want. 020 at 10, Gus 17. Okay, I'm trying to find the airport. We should we should be not, not that far away from the airport. Okay, because that's a lagging instrument. This instrument lags. Okay. You could be descending and then it takes like like a couple of seconds before it shows you that. Okay. that okay. Mile. My, my recollection is that when we were near looking at the hills last time, there was a whole bunch of uh, the the water towers. And I'm seeing that pattern over there, that picture. See over there? Yeah. All the water towers clustered in that general area. Yes. And I think that the other book was in that direction. Do you have visual sighting at the airport? I do. Okay. Is it that thing that goes like that with the white building? Yes. So you got the, the body of water, you got the green, you got that white building, and you got that thing. Yep. Okay, so we're going to be doing, the wind's coming from the north, so we're going to be doing the left. How do you know the winds are coming from the north? Because we had our, oh, sorry, never mind. Okay, I'm at 12305. I did my five yeah,
Okay, tell them you're at a 45, making that traffic. Bear one golf on a 45 for runway, 45 downwind for runway uh, 8, Lake the Hills. Lake in the Hills, Cessna 6001 golf. On a 45. On a 45. Downwind. Downwind. Runway 8. Runway 8, Lake in the Hills. Okay, start heading in towards the, the runway. I'm going to go this way? Yeah, you're going to en enter on a 45 right here. Excuse me, I'm going to be landing and heading pointing towards the west? No, you're going to go this way, downwind, base, final, this okay. way. Thank you. That's what I thought. That's what we agreed on, right, because runway 8 is pointing at 080 on the compass. So that means we're going to be landing almost due east. When I want to do it, I'll right top All right, go down a little bit. You go a little faster. Stay at 1800. That's better than altitude. So keep your, keep your nose up. So it's a little bit more power here. Let's stay at 2300. Don't descend anymore. Keep that nose up. I look for traffic. Lincoln Hills traffic, 01 Gulf, entering a downwind for runway 8, Lincoln Hills. Lincoln Hills, 6001 zero, 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 Gulf, entering traffic, downwind, Lincoln Hills. Okay, start so turning go in, go downwind. Okay, you're still descending, you don't want to descend. You have to be a thousand feet above the ground, just like that. Don't, don't climb too much either. Just, re, just stay where you're at. When I get a beam of the number, when I get a beam of the number, then I'm going to make my turn? No. That's just what I want to do. Oh, you can put cars in heat. Turn heat on. I see nothing on the runway. There's a guy six miles north of you. He's going to be landing. Try to let him land first? How are you going to let a guy six miles north land first if you're right here? I understand. Thank you. Okay. I'm going to be with the number. What are you going to do? I'm going to make a turn. No. No. You make the turn on a 45. You don't make a turn. You reduce the power and you add 10 degrees of flaps. Power at seven, uh, RPM 1700. Reduce flaps. 10 degrees. degrees. When you're 45 degrees from the runway. Now. That, that's when you're going to start your, your, your uh, don't put your nose up. You know, bring your nose up. Never on this, on this. When you're turning like this on the, on the pattern, yes. the base to final, you bring your nose up. You're going to stall the plane. So keep the nose below the horizon. Yes, sir. Keep it squared out. Right here, you can have 10 degrees of flaps. Lincoln Hills, for your 43020 on 45 for 8 Lincoln Hills. I have to state my intention. Lincoln Hills, traffic 01 Gulf on base for runway 8 for Lincoln Hills. Thank you. Sorry about that. Uh, don't turn yet. You're not, you're not supposed to turn yet. And you're supposed to be at 17. Add a little power. Just a little bit. All right. Now you're going to turn. Put the nose down. We got real low airspeed. So keep the nose down. Pitch down for airspeed. Okay. Yes, sir. Okay. Airspeed's too low. You should be at 70 here. Put the nose down. Add 10 more degrees of flaps. Alright, start letting the power out. Put the nose down. Power's all out. Okay. Now you're going to flare it out. Not, not too high, it's a little lower. Right there. Right runner. Alright. Power where the heat goes in. Flaps come up. Flaps up. Full power. Full power! We're taking off! Warrior 43020 is down land 48 Lake Canal. I have to state my intentions. Yes? Yeah, no, just take off. Fly first and then take your intentions. Get to hold it. Lake Canal traffic 01 Golf is going to stay in the pattern. Uh, for touch and goes. Lake Canal has Lincoln Hills traffic, Warrior 32403, going to taxi over to 8, Lincoln Hills. Check 
guy is going to, that guy's coming in from the north six miles in, so I got to wait for him to do that. No, he's already in the bed. Three zero two zero base eight like the hell. He's on base leg. I have to get up to eighteen hundred feet. Yes. You got to be up to to uh, thirteen hundred.
simulator and you're like an open. And this is, uh... Making my turn. Nine four four eight six West Peter uh, left uh, downwind uh, runway eight. What can I help? I'm gonna make my turn over the lake here. Yeah, thanks for turning. You're going too far out. It'll be a quarter mile. You're diving. Climb to 1800 feet. It'll be like a quarter mile from the runway. I have to keep my intentions. Call me a down one. Line service, Warrior 43020. Lake in the Hills, 6001 Golf, downwind for runway 8. Lake in the Hills. Lake in the Hills. There he is. Line service, 43020. There he is, right there. Fine service, go ahead. Yeah, there's a turtle on the runway center line about uh, three quarters of the way down from uh, runway eight, and there's one crossing the taxiway way now. I'll probably be clear in a sec. Did you see there's a turtle? Yep, I see it. Okay, thanks. I see it right there. Wait, you mean like a turtle turtle? Yep, there's a turtle right there. I don't see a goddamn thing. We're at 1800. All right. We're being the numbers. All right. So, car heat on. Reduce power. At 45 degree, ready to make my turn. You're not 45 degree. All right, yeah. Reduce the power. You got full power here. 1700. Wow. Keeping those down. This is going to be a low approach, right? Why? It's going to be a go-around. We're going to do a go-around. What is that? Go, I'll show you what a go-around is. Okay. We're, we're not going to touch okay. it up. Okay, clear of the runway 8 across Lake and Hill. Lake and Hill traffic, zero one go up on base for runway 8, Lake and Hill. Take my turn? Yeah. This is going to be a, a go-around. It's going to be just, almost like a landing. You're going to have full power, cover it, it goes in. The only difference is the flaps. You're not going to bring up the flaps. So you bring up the flaps right away, you're going to sink down to the runway. So you're going to come down and, and uh, you're going to bring the flaps one at a time, one at a time as you're climbing out. I don't have any flaps. Huh? I don't have any flaps. Oh, well, let's get the flaps done. And you're going, look at, look at the power. You're diving into the runway. I'm taking it all out. Take all the power out. I'll show you the core around, okay? Oh, yeah, 10 degrees of flaps. Okay. I want to put them all down here. Lincoln Hills, uh, zero on golf, I'm flying up for one way, freaking out. This is a go around, okay? Right. You got a turtle on the runway. Okay? Lincoln Hills traffic, zero on golf, going around. This is a go around, look at it. Like that. And then you go pick up, go to, go to the right. Look at the turtle. Lincoln Hills traffic, warrior 32403. Okay. Bring up one notch of flaps. Stay level. One notch of flaps at a time. Bring them all up, you're going to sink down to the ground. Okay? Alright, that's it. Cover it, he goes in. I saw no turtle. Did you see no turtle? I saw no goddamn turtle. Alright, keep on climbing. Goddamn. That's a goal round. Alright. Every landing is a goal round in my book. Okay? Say what now? Every landing is a goal round in my book. Yeah. If I'm coming down to land, it's going to be a go around if I have to do it. Okay. So no landing is, is a for sure thing. Okay? If there is an option of a go around, and, and uh, if it doesn't look good, you go around.
fly over the runway, sidestep, look at the runway. The reason most people do go around is because the plane goes on the runway and, and, and you're going to land and he's on the runway. So you got to make sure that you don't, that, that airplane doesn't take off and land and take off and, and go into your belly, okay? So, so you go sidestep and you're looking down at that runway making sure you see that airplane taking off. It happens more than you think. They put a, a plane in there, and, uh, especially in these uncontrolled airports. They don't see you to get on the runway. You gotta be ready to go around. Let's climb up to 2,500. Oh, there you are. For some reason, on the side. Taking the Hells Warrior 430 zero departing. Eight. Staying in the pattern like the Hells. Taking a traffic zero one golf to find traffic for the piece. Look at us. Lincoln Hills traffic order 32403, tiny crosswind for aid, Lincoln Hills. There's, there's downtown.
the rubber wheel file right there. That's the rubber wheel file right there. That one. Just keep it parallel. Stay parallel to it. Uh, whenever you're ready, give me a slow flight. I, you did your clearing turn. I need to know what to do. I'm sorry, I don't know what to do. Alright, let me just come straight to this. Alright, you wanna, first of all, you wanna calibrate it here. You wanna reduce the power to 17. Operating on parallel tech with Alpha. Alpha 700. Now you want, you wanna trim it out. You wanna get that nose up all the way. Okay, the airspeed is gonna be. 65. Okay. Okay, you see that? The airspeed is nice and slow. Yeah. You might hear the star horn going off. Yes. In that case, I put more power. Look at it. Hands off. All right. I got the trim all the way down. Trim's all the way down. Car okay. on. It's and maintaining that airspeed, right? 655 miles an hour. Five yeah. five. Yes. It's flying itself. Yes. Okay. Now, what I, the, he's going to tell you to make a left turn. So real gentle, you make a left turn. Have your hand on the flowers just in case you got to add power. Okay. See how gentle it is? Yes. Real gentle. Wow. About 53 miles an hour. Yeah, you see, you want to keep that bulk in the center here. Right, not, don't play too much with the rudder, because it'll throw you off. Right. Just a little bit, just enough to keep it in there. Okay. But look at the airspeed. It's losing altitude, okay? So I, so I want to keep that a little power. And yeah, power, but no back pressure? A little back pressure. A little back pressure and power. Just a little bit. Probably. Once you lose it, it's going to be hard to get oh, back. Out here, right? We're right under 50 miles an hour. We're heading to 45. Stall horn's going to go on any second now. Right here. Okay. So that's slow flight, okay? Okay. Now the way you recover is you put carburetor heat. Carb heat back on. I'm getting oh, Well, you know what else he could ask you? He could ask you, uh, give me some flaps so you could add flaps to this. Okay. It's going to slow you even more. Yeah. So 10 degrees at a time. Yes. 10 degrees of flaps. Right. See that? Now it gets even more sluggish. Right, we're about 51 miles, 50 miles an hour. Okay. 20 degrees, 30 degrees, 40 degrees, we're at 46, 45, 44. Stall horn's gonna go on. Stall horn's gonna go on 40 miles an hour. We're gonna have power. We're almost, yeah, under 40. We're under 40. That's okay. Stall horn. Stall horn. Power. Add a little power. Yes. Just a little power. Might add some more. Okay, 23, 20 okay. 2300, okay. Two zero, take, yeah. ramp, like, ramp. Now you're going to go, and you're going to go a little bit to the left. And if you're a sluggish, you're more sluggish, right? Yes. So, it's okay if the star one goes in and out. Heading north, 2900, 100 more 
feet. Second L traffic, quarter 
I see no aircraft in the area. We are stable at about 3,050 feet. Executive Airport Information, Papa 1352 Zulu, wind 010 at 8, visibility 10, sky is clear, temperature 18, 2.11, altimeter 3015. All right, let's runway 16 approaches in use, landing and departing runway 34 and 30. IFR able, unable to cancel oh. IFR circle, advise Chicago approach and initial contact. Advise initial contact if information is possible. Chicago Executive Airport Information Papa 13520. Okay, I have a identifier Papa. Temperature one eight. I think that's like Zurich over there. Yeah, that little one is uh, that's like Zurich. Yep. Not the one right here. Not the one right here, the one over there. This right here, that's Wakanda. Well, no, Wakanda's right there. That's this one that's for that's fish, that's fish. That's fish. That's right. Wakanda, that's like Zurich that way. Right. The south of Wakanda is like Zurich. The moment I hit, um, wind zero one zero. the moment I hit, uh, Kemper, I'm going to contact Executive Tower. I'm going to prep this to 119.8. Alright, today's been a really weird day. Runway 16 approaches in use. Landing and departing runway 4 3 0 119.9. Unable to cancel IFR circle. Advise Chicago approach to initial contact. I'm going to contact them now that I have AIDIS. Executive Tower, Cessna 6001 Golf. Inbound for landing. Chicago over Kemper. Over Kemper, inbound for landing. Right. Zulu. With 8 of Papa. Yeah, he'll give us instructions. I dropped my goddamn pen. I can't believe that. And we're too high, 3,200 feet. I want to come down to 3,000. Well, you could come down to 2,500. The reason you want to come down is because there's a layer right here that starts at 3,000. A layer? What layer? A layer from the Class Bravo airspace. Oh. You know about airspaces? Uh, uh, a Bravo and stuff like that? A little bit. Okay, you have a layer. It's like an upside down one and cake that comes down.
ILS runway 16 approaches in use. Landing and departing runway 34 and 30. IFR arrival unable to cancel IFR to circle. Advise Chicago approach and initial contact. Advise initial contact if information possible. Pepper. 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 Yeah, Pepper. Chicago Executive Airport information. Papa 1352 Zulu. Wind 010 at 8. You can call them all the way to Zurich or Kepler. Either one's a reporting point. Kepler 3015. ILS runway 16 approaches in use. Landing and departing runway 34 and 30. IFR arrival unable to cancel IFR to circle. Advise Chicago approach and initial contact. Advise initial contact. Get information. Papa. Chicago Executive Airport information. Papa 1352 Zulu. Wind 010 at 8. Visibility 10. Sky is clear. Temperature 182.11. Altimeter 3015. ILS runway 16 approaches in use. Landing and departing runway 34 and 30. IFR arrival unable to cancel IFR to circle. Advise Chicago approach and initial contact. Advise initial contact. Give information. Papa. Chicago Executive Airport information. Papa 1352 Zulu. Wind 010 at 8. Visibility 10. Sky is clear. Temperature 18. Speed right there. Altimeter 3015. Yep. That's it. Runway 16 approaches in use. Landing and departing runway 34 and 30. IFR arrival unable to cancel IFR to circle. Advise I'm going to make a little bit of a turn and then I'm going to make a go back to the airport, okay? All right. I want to be over Kemper when I mean, I, 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 I call it. Executive airport information. Papa 1352 Zulu. Wind 010 at 8. Visibility 10. Sky is clear. Temperature 182.11. Altimeter 3015. ILS runway 16 approaches in use. Landing and departing runway 34 and 30. IFR arrival unable to cancel IFR to circle. Advise Chicago approach and initial contact. Advise initial contact. Give information. Papa. I think we're going to have to go around and come down on 34. Is that correct? That's right. Executive airport information. We're going to be landing on 352 Zulu. Wind 010 at 8. Visibility 10. Sky is clear. Temperature 182.11. Altimeter 3015. ILS runway 16 approaches in use. Landing and departing runway 34 and 30. IFR arrival unable to cancel IFR to search. Advise Chicago approach and initial contact. That's it. Advise initial contact. Give information. The office building at the lake. That one. Yeah. It has water around it completely. Chicago Executive Airport like information. It has like a boat. 1352 Zulu. Wind 010 at 8. Visibility 10. Sky is clear. Temperature 182.11. Altimeter 3015. ILS runway 16 approaches in use. Landing and departing runway 34 and 30. IFR arrival unable to cancel IFR to circle. Advise Chicago approach and initial contact. Advise initial contact. Give information. Papa. Chicago Executive Airport information. Papa 1352 Zulu. Wind 010 at 8. Visibility 10. Sky is clear. Temperature 182.11. Altimeter 3015. What road is that? ILS runway 16. What road? Yeah. Standing and departing. Well, I think it's half road right here. IFR Not this one. That one. Is that half road too? Yeah, it angles out. It goes like that. Advise initial contact. Give information. Papa. Chicago Executive Airport information. Papa. 1352 Zulu. Wind 010 at 8. Visibility 10. Sky is clear. Temperature 182.11. Altimeter 3015. ILS runway 16 approaches in use. Landing and departing runway 34 and 30. IFR arrival unable to cancel IFR to circle. Advise Chicago approach and initial contact. I'm almost ready to call them. I like to be right over the air, right over the uh, site when I say, when I say my, where I am. I'm going to say executive power Cessna 6001 Golf over Kemper. Inbound for landing with uh, Aedis Papa. Yep. Uh, 702, contact Chicago departure, good day. Chicago departure, up 702, good day. Executive Tower, Cessna 6001 Golf, over Kemper, inbound for landing with Aedis Papa. 6001 Golf, Executive Tower, 05011, Gus 16634, what do you prefer? 01 Golf, runway 34, please. 43 out. 
Fire Squad, video Free Storm 33. 5 9 Delta, what's your on course heading? Uh, now make a copy, uh, 280 for now, 5 9 Delta. Fantastic.
wait till he comes on. I'll say, switch over the ground. If he doesn't tell you that within two minutes, then I would call him up. I'll ground up. That means he's really busy. Okay. But a lot of times, especially in the mornings, when it's slow and stuff like that, he'll, he'll tell you what to do. The other guy, the other ground guy, he's probably sleeping or whatever. Yeah, right. Turn it in. Not here. Yeah, oh, yeah. Was it here? Yeah. Oh. Oh, yeah. yeah. This is their home. I thought it was over there. No, 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 no. Okay. You are on the ball. Yeah, I'm falling, it, I'm falling off the ball all day. One moment, please. Don't, don't. I got him. I got him. I got him. Done. Power's out loud. Flaps are up. Uh, please, wait. Hang on a second. Uh, hold up. Lean this guy out. Heartbeat is off. Lean this guy out. And, um, this is off. Electric, uh, this is on off. That's